Hey guys, welcome to Safi Next. In this video, I will talk about the types of vectors. But before coming to that, let me tell you that in physics we deal about three different types of quantities. Number one, scalars. Number two, vectors. And number three, tensors. So we deal with three different types of quantities in physics. Now, let's go back to the types of vectors. One category of vectors is called bone vectors, and the other category of vectors is called free vectors. Bone vectors are fixed in position. For example, dealing with forces whose point of applications or the line of actions cannot be shifted it is then necessary to think about those vectors as bone vectors. Consider the case shown in this figure. Two vectors of same magnitude and direction act on two different points along a beam. Clearly, the torque produced at the supporting end and the displacement in these two cases are totally different. Therefore, forces like these are called bone forces. We cannot shift. We are not allowed to shift the points of application along the beam because that would produce different we can death because the shifting of the point of application produces different effects. So these are bound forces and in general bone vectors. Usually the concept of bone vectors is used in the case of static structures and strength of the material. In such cases, attention must be paid to their magnitudes, the point of applications and directions. On the other hand, free vectors is completely specified by its magnitude, direction and no attention is paid to the point of application. Such vectors are discussed in general and mathematical analysis and in particular in theoretical physics. That is, in theoretical physics, vectors are understood to be free vectors unless otherwise specified. So in theoretical physics, we generally talk about free vectors and without giving any reference to the point of application. At the end, I would like to remind you to please hit the like button on the video and subscribe to Safi Next. Thanks for watching.